Kathy, where's my blood pressure? Wait, nurse, why is your blood pressure going through the roof? I, I don't know. Oh, it's me. <laughs> You've done this before. I know how strong you are. Do this again. <laughs> You did that. Roger. Oh, thank you, doctor. Oh, she's beautiful. Oh, dear. There you go. I can't wait for her to meet her big sister. Rebecca. Hey, honey. I want you to meet your new baby sister. She's so cute. I love her. Now that you're a big sister, you need to love and protect her no matter what. No matter what. <laughs> we have two daughters. I have a new baby sister. And she's adorable. Do you have any more information about this program? It looks like it's built like a birth to death program. But it's all about forgiveness. Does that means somebody might die at the end of this? No, I can't take it if that happens, Daniel. No, you okay. can't me. This looks like the gel sister at Bannon's baby program. What am I doing next? It looks like your sister is still a little baby. So you're just going in to the That's nursery. That's not bad at all. Carly, you're getting to be such a big girl. <sighs> Hi, Carly. You're so pretty. You love Rebecca, don't you? Your little sister Carly loves you so much. Much, huh? Do you think that's the baby that's gonna be abandoned? I don't know, you might be right. I have to use the restroom really quick. Can you just keep an eye on your sister? I'll be right back. Hi. Oh no. Oh no, are you okay, Carly? I'll always protect you. What's going on? This toy almost fell on Carly's head. <gasps> Carly, are you okay? Thank you, Rebecca. That could have been really terrible. You are such a good big sister. I love your big sister too. <gasps> big sisters are the best, aren't they? I hope you two stay best friends forever. Did you see that? I just saved her life. My sister is definitely gonna be my best friend. It's gonna be easy to forgive her. I think so, Rebecca. It looks like it's gonna get harder next time you go back in. Okay, Daniel, see about that. There's no way my little sister would do anything wrong to me. Perfect timing, Rebecca. I just made up a healthy snack for you and your sister. Here, have a seat, you guys. Remember, it's important to always eat healthy. What's that time clock right there? Oh, it's ticking backwards. That. Why is there a time clock now? What happens if she doesn't finish the game in time? I don't know about this. That better not be the death part, Daniel. Okay. Come on. Okay, get in let's there. Find out. By the way, Rebecca, your gymnastics teacher just called and said she is very impressed on how much you have been improving. How come her teachers always say good things about her and not me? It's okay. When you're my age, all the teachers will give you compliments too. Rebecca is right, Carly. They're gonna love you as well. You just have to practice a little more. Do you wanna go practice gymnastics? Yeah. Yes, that's actually fine. We can do snacks later. Why don't you guys go do some fun gymnastics? And Rebecca, just help out your sister, okay? Go ahead. I'm gonna go watch them. Just love their relationship. Rebecca doesn't know this, but if she makes it through this program, we're gonna give one of you guys in the Zamfam an iPhone so that make sure that you are subscribed and have notifications on so you can win that iPhone. Now we're going to start with the handstand. Here, watch. How do you do that? Fastest, now you try. Girls, I'm getting a call, I need to take this. Um, it's okay, do you wanna just try the handstand again? I'm never gonna be as good as you. That's why everybody hates me and mom loves you more. That's not true, let's just go back to the handstand, okay? That little sister is really jealous. Well, it must be hard having a perfect older sister. Ugh. Ow! Ah, she pushed Yeah, that was definitely a push on purpose. Hey! What happened? She pushed me. Carly, why would you do that to your sister? <laughs> I'm sorry. I just got mad because I couldn't do a cartwheel. That's not an excuse. Are you okay? Carly, get down here. Say you're sorry to your sister. I'm sorry, Rebecca. It's okay, I forgive you. Oh, Rebecca forgave her, so she passed the level, right, Daniel? Yeah, she did, but <gasps> look at that smile. I think she faked it. I'm sorry, Carly, but you have to go to timeout. That sister's a faker. Your little sister, she's faking it. She's super jealous yes, and a it. faker. You guys, Big relax. I got hurt. It was an accident, and she apologized. I forgave her. That's what I'm supposed to do in this program, right? We really pushed you on purpose. You could have got hurt in okay. there. You said that this was extreme, but it's easy to forgive her. I mean, she didn't mean to. Yes, yeah, she did. Well, good luck going back in. Can I play? It's not your turn yet. I have five more minutes. But you've been playing on this game for like an hour. No, it's only been 15 minutes. I want to watch my favorite show. Let me have it. Give it to me. No, give it to me. You have one more minute. The minute's not over. <laughs> what is going on here? She broke it. What? She had it. <gasps> oh, they broke the iPad. That little sister is gonna be so in trouble. I didn't break it. I still had one more minute of screen time and then she came over and started tugging it from my hand. Rebecca, this is an iPad. This is very expensive and it was your screen time. You are in big trouble, Missy. I'm sorry. You are grounded. But there was one more minute left and she was trying to take it from You're me. You're grounded. Why did you do that? You're so mean. I'm sorry. 
sorry. I just didn't want to get in trouble again. If she found out about this, she would ground me even more. She threw her older sister under the bus and that is such a big cry. I guess I forgive you. Where'd she go? Look at that smirk and then she's chewing on that pink gum. I love that flavor. <gasps> Okay, Daniel, it's getting a little harder. Exactly, I mean, she I told you. She blamed me for breaking that iPad, but she apologized, and that's what matters, right? I'm surprised you forgave her for that. I mean, if the apology was real, then it matters. This is gonna be easy to complete, and obviously I'll be able to forgive before death, so. Ooh, this next level looks tough. What? Is it dying? You're gonna be in high school now, getting ready for prom. Prom? Ooh, I love prom. Who's my date? I hope he's someone cute and hot. No, yet. He's your date, Daniel. Oh, I can't believe that prom is today. Hey, Carly, do you know where mom is? No. She said she was gonna help me get ready. Mmm, I love it. So did you decide which boy you're gonna take to prom? I mean, it was kind of tough. Three guys asked me, and it was a hard decision, but I'm going with Eddie. It's not fair, all the boys like you. No, Carly, you're just younger than me. I mean, when I was your age, no boys liked me. I don't even get to go to prom right now. Because you're too young, I'm a junior, and you're still in middle school. When you're in high school, School, you'll get to go to prom just like me. It'll be worth it and I'm sure you'll have like 25 guys wanting to go to prom with you. Doesn't matter, I mean I'm not even gonna look as pretty as you do right now. Carly, that's not true at all, but could you help me zip up my dress? Mm -hmm. I know it's a little soon, but things are going pretty good with Eddie. I mean, he might be the one. I mean, obviously marriage is like way too soon. She just put gum in Rebecca's hair. She's trying to sabotage her prom and that girl looks like me. I would never do that to Rebecca. She looks like you? I don't see it What do you mean you don't see it? Okay, you're all He's good. He's still really cute. Really? Mm -hmm. Anything for you, sis? Uh, he's here. Do I look okay? Yeah, you look great. Wish me luck. Uh -huh. Hi, Eddie. Hi, Rebecca. Ew, that's Rebecca's prom date. She's gonna be disappointed. Says the jealous sister. Oh, so now you agree I look like her? No, she has a way better wig than yours. And she's not a wig! Oh, you ready for prom? I am very ready for prom. Oh, you haven't met yet. This is my adorable sister, Carly. Carly, this is Eddie, the one I was telling you about. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Uh, sisters? You don't yeah. look that much alike. Oh, oh, I almost forgot. I have something for your outfit. You do? It's like the new thing. It's a mini boutonniere. I've been reading about those on Pinterest. What's the jealous sister doing to her pants or her dress? This is gonna be the most embarrassing prom. You look very handsome. You look today. very pretty. You ready to go? I'm ready to go. Right, let's do this. Prom. Back soon. Have fun. You look great. Thanks. Perfect. Why does it feel like everyone's laughing at me? It's something really funny. It's not you though, for sure. Everyone's laughing at her at prom. How is she gonna forgive her sister for this? And the Zampam is never gonna win an iPhone. Are you happy, Maddie? I am not the jealous sister! Thanks again for inviting me to prom. I'm having a really good time. The best time ever. <laughs> Speaking of best time, this is my jam! Oh, oh, uh, uh. What do you mean? Don't, don't, don't face them. Your dress is in your granny panties. What? Let me get it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I know. You wear granny panties. Oh no. Do you think they all saw that? They definitely did. But just forget about yeah, it. Yeah. We're at prom. <gasps> gum. What is that? There's gum in my hair. How is there gum in my hair? Hey, gum. I know who choose this. Everybody's laughing at us right now. You're embarrassing me. This is supposed to be the best night of her life. I have to go. Hey. <laughs> No, you do not want to deal with the wrath of Mad Rebecca, not even in the metaverse. Your gum was in my hair, why did you do that? That was just a prank, your hair will grow back. And my dress tucked in, was that you too? Oh yeah, you should have seen how funny you looked. <laughs> why are you laughing, that is not funny. <laughs> and he's never gonna talk to me again, this is the worst day of my life and this is all your fault. <laughs> it was just supposed to be a joke. All the boys like you and I just wanted to make it a little more fair, I mean it. The gum, you can't even like grow your hair back. Now I feel bad. It's okay, I still have another year and it'll grow back, okay? I don't know where you get to thinking that boys don't like you. Eddie said that we don't look alike at all. That doesn't mean anything, just because we look different doesn't mean we both can't be beautiful. Why don't we forget that this happened, I'll forget that you put gum in my hair and the whole dress thing and let's just erase today, okay? What? How did she forgive her? That's what the program was supposed to do though, right? Good job, yeah, Rebecca. I guess, yeah, she did pass that level. Wanna watch a movie? Yeah. Can I have some Skittles? Mm-hmm. Honestly, I just wanna forget about prom. It's still kinda funny though. 
Woo. Prom didn't quite go the way I thought it would. My sister did do a few things wrong, but I kind of understand where she's coming from. I mean, it must be hard. It must she, be hard for her. Okay, you guys, stop giving me a hard she time. You like your best day ever. Let's just move on to something else. I want to complete this program, right? So yeah. I should be forgiving. You did a good job, Beck. Ooh. Thank you. Did you guys, by the way, shout out anyone in the Zam Fam for merch? No. Okay, oh. well, I will shout them out right here. And if any of you guys want all of our new merch, go to RebeccasMold.com and tag me on Instagram. What am I doing next? It's your wedding day. There's nothing that she could do on my wedding day. That's like the best day of my life, right? I wonder who I'm marrying. Yeah, let's see. <gasps> Eddie! Yes, I knew it! Getting married to Eddie even after that whole prom disaster? This is so exciting. This will be easy. All I have to do is forgive, but what could go wrong? I mean, it's my wedding day. Big day, are you nervous? Yeah, I'm super nervous. Can good. I see your vows? Yeah, of course. Just don't know if they're any good. Wow. She's gonna love them. You think so? Mm hmm. Jealous sisters switch the vows! Oh no, this is gonna be bad. Zamfam, comment down below. Do you think Rebecca's gonna be able to forgive her sister for what's about to happen? All right, for the bride. Better get going. We are gathered here today to witness the union of Sexy Eddie <laughs> and Rebecca. <laughs> Sorry, Mom. Uh, the two have chosen to write their own vows. Eddie, this comes from the heart. When I first met you and we went to prom, I could have never imagined that I'd still be here standing today. I'm so lucky and I'm so happy. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. How are you gonna top that, Eddie? I wrote something down. Rebecca, I'm so lucky to be marrying you. Well, these vows don't seem that bad. I love you just the way you are. Not that pretty, needy, and selfish. <gasps> you make me a better person. And I'll try to make you a better person since you're the worst. Spending the rest of my life with you will be a challenge. A challenge I really don't want to do. Ooh. I do not like that Carly sister. She is bad news. Those were great, what? Eddie. Good job. What happened? Let's we'll skip to the, to the kissing. Yes. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. I don't think that Rebecca's gonna do this and you guys won't win the iPhone! There's no way she's gonna pass this level. You okay? I'm okay, yeah. <laughs> what is it laughing? <laughs> Even with all this going on, just being with you is what matters. Really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> this isn't that bad. They're having a good time. Whoa, guys, your video is going viral right now. Your wedding is viral. What? Let's get that out. Is this vows? That's not Eddie's handwriting. Get over here. What? I can't believe that that happened at your wedding. Carly, the vows. You switched the vows. Why would you do this? You tried to ruin my wedding. I was writing a play and I was just getting inspiration from your wedding and I must have accidentally just like given them to him. I'm sorry that I ruined your wedding day. It's okay. I'm really glad you're here. You're the only sister I have. But why would Rebecca forgive her sister? Oh, if I was in that program, there is no way that I would forgive her. I mean, she is jealous and she is just the worst. I love you. She falls for it every time I cry. <gasps> Whoa. Hey, Rebecca. Welcome back. You seriously forgave her? I, I have to, Maddie. That's part of the program. She ruined your wedding. This was the extreme level. It was extreme, but you guys, I still feel bad for her. At the end of the day, she still apologized, and I genuinely feel like she meant it. <laughs> Wait, you really meant the apology, too? Whoa. Okay, well, Daniel, let's just do this. What's going to be happening Whoa, next? this is a big change. Oh, no. Death, Rebecca. You guys already it? had a baby. <laughs> what? Yeah. A baby? Yeah. Don't hit the baby. My name is Mama. Ma, ma, ma. Your name is Baby. Baby, baby, baby. I love you so much. Oh, that baby looks so familiar. Wait, do you think that's the baby that she's gonna abandon? Not that baby. Mommy's getting a call before her business meeting. Hello? What do you mean you can't babysit? Oh, you're sick. Um, okay, yeah, no, no, that's totally fine. You, you shouldn't be around her if you're sick. No problem. Bye. Oh no, what am I gonna do? Hey, I brought you Perrier since I drank your last one. Oh. What's wrong? It's just I have a really important meeting that I am about to have to cancel. Eddie's at work and the babysitter just canceled. I can babysit. Rebecca, I'm here. It's okay. The meeting wasn't that important. I'm sure they can reschedule. Rebecca, I'm not the same person that I used to be. You can trust me. Eddie. I can babysit her. I've changed, you know that. Oh, it looks like her sister's had like a change of heart. Like she's really changed as a person. I think she's faking it just like she has all the other times. Do you wanna get babysat by your auntie? You can babysit her, just stay here, don't leave the house, and I'll okay. be back in like 30 minutes. Okay, we'll be fine. Okay, I love you. Hi, 
your Auntie Carly is gonna be babysitting you today. Oh yeah, I'm excited too. Okay, little belly rubs, belly rubs. Hello? Oh hey, you actually wanna go on a date? Don't go on that date. I cannot believe I'm saying this, Don't but do not go on that date. Don't go on the date. Okay, yeah, I can meet you at the park in 15 minutes. She's going on a date. Of course she is. How bad can it be? How bad can a date with a baby be? Okay, awesome, see you then. Bye. <gasps> Guess what? We're about to go on a field trip together. Just don't tell your mom. Hi, it is so hey, nice to meet I'm you. I'm glad you swiped right. Yeah, me too. Oh my gosh, you have like a picnic set Ready up? to go, let's sit. Your name's Carly? Yeah, and your name's Joey? Joey. Nice to meet you in real life. Oh, and the baby's not mine. I was just doing a favor for my sister. Uh. The baby was right here. I just left the stroller right here. What? The jealous sister just abandoned the baby at the park! What do you think's gonna happen to the baby? You think someone's gonna take it? Wait, did you see where the baby went? No. Oh my god, my sister's gonna come Okay, um, baby? Baby scavenger hunt, I'll help. And that's why I think this could be very beneficial to every- I'm so sorry, one sec. It's my sister, she is watching my baby in uh, two seconds. Carly, I'm in the middle of my meeting, what is going on? What do you mean you lost her? You're supposed to be at home. What? Where are you? Drop me a pin. I'll be there as soon as I can. Oh no. Where is she? Where is the baby? My sister is going to kill me. I need to find her baby. I can't mess up another thing in her life. Baby? Baby, where did you go? Carly? She lost my baby. I am never going to forgive her for this. Where is she? Carly? Oh my god, Rebecca is so upset right I'm now. I'm freaking out. There's no way she's going to forgive her sister for this. Carly, have you found her? No, I'm so sorry. Hey, did you check over here? Come on. <laughs> where is she? Did someone take her? They showed I found the baby, what do I win? Are you okay? Oh my god. She's okay. She's okay. Rebecca, I'm sorry. No. I have forgiven you my whole life, but this is the last straw. I am done. Rebecca, I am done. You just almost lost my daughter. I don't want to talk to you ever again. I promise it was an honest mistake. Stop it. Me. The crying's not going to work this time. I'm sorry, Rebecca. <laughs> No! <laughs> Rebecca, you did not pass that level. You didn't forgive her. No, I just okay? like, I was freaking out. Like, what if that was Zadie in real life? I would be so mad. How am I supposed to forgive her for that? Losing your baby is kind of a big deal. No, but you have to go back in. You have to find a way to forgive her. It's just a program, right? Hey, it's it's been not Zadie. A lot of people are counting on you for this one, Rebecca. I, a lot of people. I don't think I can do this. I'm sorry, you guys. I don't think I can do this. Fams, make sure that you comment that she can do this in the comment section down below. We need to get you guys an iPhone. Hi. Hey, happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. This is beautiful, Eddie. This setup is amazing. And there is no one I would rather spend Thanksgiving with than the two of you. Just the three of us. Calm and relaxing, huh? Wait, why did she set three place settings? She's a baby. She can't eat real Thanksgiving food. Not this year. It is Thanksgiving and I invited somebody. Really? Who did you invite? Hey. Oh, Eddie, what did you do? I'm trying to bring everybody together. It's Thanksgiving, Daniel. Come on. Okay. Maybe now she'll forgive her sister. Good point, good point. What is Carly doing here? Why did you invite her? Rebecca, you only have one sister. It's Thanksgiving. I told you I never want to see that horrible person again. Rebecca, I was hoping that we could talk. No, there is no talking. You're the reason that we almost lost our baby. You have done enough to me my whole life, and I am done with you. You guys can have Thanksgiving without me, because I am done. Please, Rebecca, I'm just I'm out of here. I have to follow her. She did not forget her Whoa. sister. Mm -mm. It's feeling worse than before. <laughs> Where's she gonna go? Why is she driving away? <laughs> the sister just snuck into the trunk. Zim fam, go back. Did you see that? What? <laughs> Rebecca, what are you doing? Please, can you just talk to me? We can't do this right now. Rebecca, please. I'm pulling over. See, the sister's in the car. Maybe they can talk about it and then Rebecca can forgive her. Rebecca, look, I know that I've been jealous of you growing up and I've done a lot of things that were not nice, but when I abandoned your baby, I really didn't mean for that to happen. I promise. And I'm really sorry. Can you please forgive me? You know what? I swore I would never say this again. A car! To white. I don't see what's after this. I just know that you have to go back in if you get you to okay? forgive her. If I didn't forgive her, then I didn't beat the program. No, no, you have to go back in. Did I die or did I not? What I, happened to I us? have no idea. We won't know until you go back into the program. Okay, okay. Here you go. Where am I? 
I didn't get a chance to forgive my sister. Where, where is she? What happened? Doctor! You're awake. What happened to my sister? You were in a very bad car accident with your sister. You have internal bleeding. You're here in the ICU. Where is she? I need to see her. I need to let her know it wasn't her fault. I'm sorry to show you this, but she hasn't woken up yet. Carly? Carly? Rebecca, listen to me. You don't have much time. I'll be back. I have to go. Carly! I know you didn't mean to lose my baby. It wasn't your fault. You made a mistake. Can I forgive you? Please wake up. Wake up, Carly, please. Rebecca? Carly, it's not your fault. I'm sorry, Rebecca. I forgive you. I love you, sister. I love you, sister. We'll be sisters forever. Uh, both of them? I did it. You did. You passed the program. I forgave her right before it was too late. Okay, Zam fam, I don't want to go back into that program, but I definitely learned that life is too short and you just need to forgive sooner. In the blink of an eye, they were both gone. Okay, it feels super weird bringing this up right now, but Rebecca, since you passed the program, we're gonna give one of the subscribers a free iPhone. You did that without me. It's my channel. O okay, fine. Uh, Make sure you're subscribed. This is one of our past iPhone winners. Hi, Matt and Rebecca. I got the iPhone 13 in the mail today. I'm so grateful. Thank you so much. This means so much to me. So if you want an iPhone, comment below your Instagram handle, make sure notifications are on. And Daniel, what other programs are there? It looks like there's one for divorced parents oh. and another one for twin separated at birth. Sam fam, comment below which of those programs you think we should do.